Hello everyone, we're now going to be looking at how to issue a credit note. So a credit note simply entails the reversal of a transaction. To do this, we will have the original invoice of the transaction we want to reverse. So take for instance, this is our invoice. So we go to our machine, under our administrator mode, we come to number three, which is our invoice management. Then we come to our credit note, number three. We just verify to ensure that our invoice code is the same as our invoice number. We press enter and enter our invoice number, which is the exact same invoice number that's on our original slip. So we enter our invoice number there. It will ask us to give reasons. So make sure your reasons are valid and clear because when this information hits our server, we're able to see why you are reversing the transaction. So your reasons should be clear and valid. So if this was a customer who brought back a good, we'll simply say return. We'll simply type it out and say return. Return. You can say return of good. Return of goods. We press enter. Then it will ask you to say press FN to return all. Whether you sold 50 items or whether you sold one, as in this case, you still return everything. You can't return, you can't issue a credit note on a particular product. So you, you return all. And then if they want, if they're only returning one and want to keep the rest of the items, you issue a new invoice for the things that they're keeping. Remember, this is an important note. Remember that you can't issue a credit note for a single item, but for all items. And then you issue a fresh invoice on what the customer is keeping.